everybody and welcome back so today I have another beautiful DIY for you guys it's something really simple yet elegant that anyone can recreate so if you guys are interested in seeing what I have created today just keep on watching I'll be starting off with these gems that I already had and I picked them up from Dollar Tree I'll also be starting with this flower vase and it is from Dollar Tree as well If you're new to my channel, welcome! It's so great to have you here. Don't forget to subscribe as well as hitting the notification button so you'll be notified whenever I upload a video. Here you just see me trying to decide where to place my gems. I didn't really have a real method to doing this project. I just ultimately decided on doing like an up-down pattern so that I would have as much coverage as possible. going in with this clear plate that's from Dollar Tree. For the sake of this video, I'm going to be using hot glue, but if you guys want a more permanent solution, do use some sort of glue like Gorilla Glue or something like that so that you'll have a stronger hold. Now I'm going to be using these bling stickers that I picked up from Michaels. with this Chang Link bling that I picked up from E Favor Mart. I'll also be using these crystals which are also from E Favor Mart. just see me detaching the chain link from the crystal and I'm doing this because I wanted to have one crystal per hoop as well as a hoop on either end of my chain. Here's what it should look like. So now I'm just gonna attach my large crystal.
Now I'm just going in with my hot glue gun. I decided to lay my gems out around the design to make it a little bit easier to work. You can definitely skip this step if you like. This is strictly optional. I used a ruler to make sure my spacing was even. everybody that's it that's all that I have today thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe as well as hitting the notification button and I'll see you guys next time bye guys